It's not that I can't do the Helmbreaker. It's just that it's about chance. For me, I use this... I use the first or second Helmbreaker to determine if it's worth maintaining. I probably wasn't going to get a Triple S anyway. So I'm not missing double out. Double star. I know. I'm not missing out on anything. Okay, so what do we have here? We have a double star on this table. Items to destroy. Uh, Place you can't go. An elevator that appears to be blocked. And... A hallway. And a blue door. That leads to nowhere else but a proud soul. I mean, is it a lost soul or a proud soul? I stopped paying attention after this... This game, you know, they should, have, they should have just kept the same name. I mean, l let's put it this way. It, it, it is a lost soul, because there's nothing to be proud of when I see this game. Well, okay, there are a few things. Okay, can I jump on... on can I jump at, to a Looks grapple like there's point? a... I'm ask. Hold on, I'm just searching around. I'm surveying. Yes, there is a grapple point right there, but I'm not going to use it. What was it you were saying? Looks like there's an, another... Oh, uh, grapple or door over there. Okay, look. Grapple or door where? There's only one. Behind you. Back in the... Under the... See? See the blue? Yeah. Yes, you're right. Oh, no, but that's just a grapple point. But do I really need it? No, I, I came I need to get from... back up there. Yeah, but I don't need to because there's a second point here. No, actually, it turns out there's uh, a chain event for grapples up there. We will see. Okay. There is a proud soul, and it's still here somewhere. Lost might... soul, whatever. A lost soul, proud soul. It might be... It is might, it behind that desk? No. It might be that I have to use the first grapple in order to get to the second. What? Oh, maybe I had to shoot it to slow down the stock. Whatever that is moving around. Is that second door? There we go. Thanks for showing me the way. I just wanted to see if there were any other objects nearby. Come on, Virgil. Hang on, Dante. Virgil, just be careful you don't trigger the tempering mechanism. Bingo. 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 It's not bingo. Not bingo. Dill hole. It's called oh, Jack. That's bullshit. They could have kept that in, but they didn't. Yeah, I know. Just have to wait for it to time out a bit. Oh man. This one's the middle. Oh. Yeah, like I meant, like I meant. You to, can only do I one jump to, and trip. I meant to descend and then dash. Another one. Great. How many? How many other twins does he have? Yeah, this one's different. Looks like there's a, it's a triplet show. Cause the first one, was, the first one you saw was red. The second one was white, and this one's black. Are they trying to make a play on the Sentai or, or uh, Power Ranger thing? Time to get you out of the way. Oh. I went up a little too fast because of the demon evade having given me a little more augmentation for my power up. Oof. You know, they should have an obstacle here where if I do trip an alarm, I can face the demon. Although, to be fair to the game, Mundus has already found me. Sort of. Okay, it's telling me to go right, but is there anything here to the left? Yes, there is. Wait, are we back in the same room? I don't think so. It looks like the same room, but yeah. it isn't. No, this looks isn't... like they just re reused the design. Yeah, they reused assets. I mean, it's a pretty wide complex overall. I have enough double trigger, so I'll be fine. I don't, I don't need it, anything else. Am I still in combat, though? Nope. Divinity Statue. I'm not going to stop here. I'm going to keep going. 
Okay, so the next here. Just because it's glowing blue, a lot of people seem to think that it's of interest. No, it's not glowing. Here, here you will rendezvous with Virgil. Here. Seems you underestimated Cat. I didn't. I really care about her. About you know, I seem to be. You once said you didn't give a shit. You once said you didn't give a shit. I seem to understand that they're trying to build Virgil, like. Here, As a character here, they're not trying to directly it's show us who he is. Guard. They're trying to Might look have him sort of, world, but it's a powerful like demon weapon. Like he's coding his personality is what I can see, and he's slowly letting himself out because he's amongst humans. First, he's th he's threatening to he he simply feels on a bent. <laughs> I'm sorry, let me speak. There's too many people talking here. I haven't talked at all. No, I'm I'm referring to her. Okay, Kablooey. Fires explosive needles that stick in enemies and can manually be detonated. Okay. Shot and jump and shot simultaneously. Shoot and death. Okay. Now, let me tell you. The thing is with Virgil, though, we've already seen two aspects to what might be reminiscent of his class. No, no, it's not. It's just done differently. Like, he is a douche here, but you're, but you're seeing signs of it. You're seeing signs of his true nature as a demon. And uh, more as a hybrid, I should say. Like, we have him wanting to abandon Cat. To leave her to her death because she's not empowered like that. We also have her shooting Lilith point blank, well not, not point, really point blank, but sniping her. And we also have him killing humans. So they're trying to act as though he doesn't care about about anything but of his own nature. Or the mission more likely. No, he cares about He's more like, uh, they're trying to portray him as a, uh, you know, like those radicals or extremists that are in any, any group, really. But I, no, but what I'm saying is that they're trying to retain his character, or uh, they're trying to explore a side that is terrible. That, like, they, I don't know. Like, we're gonna see Virgil betray Dante, all right? That's that, because that's what they that's what they would do. They need it in order to sell this game as a, as a retaining lore in the Devil May Cry series. And if they don't. They're probably gonna do what they did in uh, Prototype. They're gonna make the first one that he's a hero and helping you, and the second one, then he's your villain. I mean, keep in mind that I've seen some leaks, and uh, I, I won't go any further than that, but I'm going to tell you right now that everything else I'm saying still remains true. Okay, Proud Souls. Lost Souls, I'm sorry, just keep. Like, it, it's, two, it's two different names, but the same system, pretty much. Okay, I have three, three human arms, two, two heaven weapons, two hell weapons. Now what? I think you have to go straight to the door. Yeah. Oh no, there's an elevator. Elevator. Uh, no, I mean um, a sliding door. Sliding door. Sky bridge. Yeah. Sky bridge. Yeah. I, my, I'm sorry, guys. I'm kind of brain farting right now. This whole game expects me to just not go to performance part because my gameplay right now it's a little off maybe it's the nature of the environment okay nothing here but a soul I mean a cocoon yeah really we're done here I like how they're playing catchy elevator music to pass the time. I don't. I hope they don't copyright me for that and take right. my stuff down. This is hell. <sighs> <laughs> oh, I. Oh man, if I had to battle them in the elevator, actually, that camera would help. <laughs> I hope this is the last area. Hey, let's check out your new human weapon. See how it would do against the harpies. Because we already know shotgun makes them fall. What about the other one? We'll see. Oh, it does a multi. It just knocks them back. Let me see if I can use different guns. Nope. 
fireworks. Okay, one will affect them for now. Oh, your new gun just knocks him back. And Rage Breaker. The Kablooey is extremely useful for getting in behind enemy defenses. Using four darts, it's even possible to break enemy in rage states. Okay, press the shot button to fire darts, press the jump and shot button at the same time to detonate. So I can fire more than one. Finally! I make it I rather us something help to help us with those big dudes. Literally, they're just annoying at a certain point. That was because of my power up from the dodge. Okay, him? Perhaps I could use this on. Dread. I really hope this is the last fight for this level because this recording is going to take a lot of a lot of my work to have edited. No high class warrior with guts and honor like Nello and in this game. Everyone here is a total douchebag. Oh, looks like you can use that to stun it. So, listen up guys, it looks like we just found a strategy. Hit him with the darts. And oh, he, he, hold on, he's parrying it. Yeah. I have to make sure they all stick to him. And you can use the stun him so you can get some damage in. Just dodge, dart, stab. Or evade, and then stab. Didn't respond there. Trying to see my stinger. How long does that thing stay on? It's been on there for a while. Yeah. No. Okay, if this world hates me, it's like, make it known. Who is this world? Is this world a being, or is this just a, a dimension that's alive? Like, like, as an individual. I think that when the color of the platform changes, it indicates that I don't have long to stay on. Yeah, it's constantly moving. I think you have to get to that platform before the angel. Yep. yep. Yeah, because in the church it glow it glowed yellow temporarily. Knock, knock. I was about to say blue. Like paste. Okay. Forty two minutes in that mission. I mean from our end. Yours you probably spent like, I don't know, twenty or thirty minutes. And I don't care how well I did. Alright. See you next time. Remember, this is Devil May Cry DMC. The game that you don't want to play, but the one that we 